Okay, uh, greetings, this is Damon Stiff with Austin Warrior Arts and Seth Decote. Um, we're gonna demonstrate some basic angle of attacks. Now for our system, for simplicity's sake, uh, we use a counting system. Um, we pretty much count our strikes from one through eight, and those are gonna be our main slashes, our main cuts. Uh, there are thrusting attacks uh, that you will find uh, that we use, but typically in Tuareg sword fighting, you'll see mostly um, slashing cuts or strikes that kind of move and travel completely through or these broken strikes where the blade is cast out, hits the target and comes back. So um, before we do this from a guard, we're gonna do it from just kind of a, um, like a um, like an open position, just so that the strikes can flow. So this is something you can kind of work on at home just from this, this, this neutral guard here. So I'll start here with my angle one will be a diagonal slash and cut all the way through. Angle two, backhand, diagonal slash, angles three, Forehand, uh, diagonal slash, four, um, backhand, diagonal slash. Now our number five and six are horizontals, can be done high, or they can be done mid, the body, and even low um, with changing our levels here, okay? So once again, we have angle one, two, three, four, five high, six high, we go five mid, six mid. Next seven overhead and then eight is a vertical that comes straight up once again i go one two three four five six seven through eight now the um the overhead strike is pretty common but this underneath one you don't find it as much in two hours sword play you find that more in the um, algerian stick fighting art of uh which is this is like one of the uh the, the third strike in their four strike sequence. Anyways, one more time from a different angle. I'm gonna turn this way. And I'm missing this like regular, uh, just kind of an open guard here. And I'll start. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and reset. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, so yeah, so angles as opposed to like have a specific name for each strike so we find for our reconstruction it makes it a lot easier um, so if you have any questions about this material um, you know hit me up on YouTube or Facebook um, and this is something like I said you guys can practice this our next series what we'll do is we'll do those same strikes uh, from the guard positions that we've shown before the uh, the four high guards and we'll see like which strikes relate most to those positions so anyways thank you for joining in and practice hard train hard be safe and uh, we'll see you soon